Hey guys, so this is the first video of Dish Dash tutorials and you guys really wanted uh, programming tips, so that's what I'm going to do today. Here we have a coin that I just drew, but we can make that better by adding this script. You can see how simple this is right here. It only has a few parts, and as I take it apart, you guys can see how it works. You can also use this in the uh, on the X coordinate plane to make it go the other way, so left and right. Here we have my apple from Fruit Clicker. You can see how smooth it is when you just put the mouse over it. Look at that smoothness. It's super easy to recreate. You just have, this is what you do. And you can also have this so that when you click on it, it goes down. The apple moving is called player feedback. Player feedback is when something happens when the player does something. Everything does something, and so that's what makes it a really good game. What I did was I remixed Fruit Clicker, and I removed every single bit of player feedback. So now you can see nothing happens when the mouse goes over, nothing happens when the player does anything. So you can click it and your score goes up, which is actually what you see in a lot of clicker games. If you want to make your clicker game better, you want things to do something, because now this is just really boring. Whereas the other one, everything is moving, everything does something, and that's why player feedback is very important. Thanks for watching. This is my first episode of uh, programming tips. If you guys enjoyed it, hit the like button and maybe we can do another one. It would really help me if you subscribe and don't miss out on the latest videos that are going to be way better than this. Thanks and bye.